it's almost that time. Yes, it is. What What are some of your thoughts and feelings on, on the anticipation of the start of the season? Uh-huh. I'm excited, you know, just every single day giving it my all and giving, you know, giving all my energy to this. You know, I feel like it'll all pay off in the end, and I'm just excited to do it with my teammates and be in this amazing environment with the best fans in the country. What have, what have you seen out of the team so far? What, what's, what's practice been like? I definitely see a lot of intensity. Um, everyone's hungry. Everyone wants to get back to the final four and even more. So, you know, you see that intensity every single day. And you just have to try to match it and um, keep stacking days and good days on top of each other. You know, Coach talked about, you know, Louisville achieving a lot of success without getting that championship. How difficult was it to go through the season and to, to have a run so deep and not win it all? But this year, you guys are, you know, is that fuel for you guys this year? What, how much do you talk about that? Yeah, um, I definitely feel like this team and last year's team, you know, they were all hungry to get to the uh, Final Four. You know, you can see it in their uh, preparing and, you know, playing on the court. And I'm just excited to be a part of this and, you know, help help get back to that Final Four and in that championship. Um, I feel like we can do it and I feel like every single day um, we show each other that we got each other's back and that means a lot. So what do you bring to this team? What, what, what are some of the things that uh, you feel you're skilled at? Yeah, um, I would definitely say I bring my speed to the team, you know, just getting up and down, getting people involved, making the right passes, and like making the right reads. Um, and just getting, yeah, like just getting people open shots and creating for myself. I think I bring that to the team and just being vocal and being a leader and just being bringing the best version of myself every single day, whether, it's a, whether that's on offense or on defense. How good is this team? How, how good do you think you guys can be? Of course, everybody says we want to cut down right. the nets and things like that. But how, how good do you think this team can be? Right. I think this team can be great. You know, right now we're, we're good and we're still working, but I feel like we can get to that part where we're unstoppable. And I'm excited for that. And it gives me chills every single day thinking about it because when you look around and you look at the pieces, you know, we're deep. And, and I'm just excited. I'm excited to play with these girls. I'm excited to see what we bring this year. So. I gotta ask you about Coach. Yes, sir. He's a character. <laughs> He's a character. He's definitely a character, man. But uh, he pushes us every single day to be the best version of ourselves. And, you know, he's never going to let us take any shortcuts. And that's what I love about him the most because he's going to give us his best effort. And, you know, it's it's no deal breaker to give our best effort every single day also. So, you know, I love playing for him. Um, he's, he's pushing me, and I, I love it, you know. We go at it. Um, and, you know, He's never going to let me slack in practice, and that's what I love about him. That's what I love about this team, because they're always going to hold each other accountable, and I feel like that's what makes a great team. i got to ask you about, you know, what was the process of, of learning each other on the court? What, was that, you know, how easy or how difficult is it right. to, to get the new people in, the, the people who've already, the veterans, and, you know, how well or how easy is it to come together for the squad? You know, I feel like actually when you when you think about it, it's it's not that hard. You know, I feel like you have to learn people outside outside of the court first before you know try to learn them on the court because you, know, you have to you have to build those relationships. And I feel like we all did a great job, you know, hanging out with each other in the all season and in the summer and just getting to learn each other so we know how each other how we can talk to one another because you know everyone you can't talk to the same. So it's it's been good, you know, and I feel like we all love each other and we all care about each other, and that what makes us great because we're all gonna run through a wall. For now each I, other. Got, I gotta ask you about about the schedule. When you look at that schedule, I, are they all the same, or is there one is there one or two particular games where you like, man, I can't wait for that? Um, you know, I feel like. They're, they're all, you, you have to look at them all the same. You have to look at them all as they're your, your hardest competition because, you know, if you don't, that's when you, you let up and you don't give your best. So I feel like when you're looking at the schedule, you have to think, oh, wow, let's, let's let's take care of them and then we'll move on to the next one. But I'm just excited to, you know, to play in the tournament and play, you know, the best teams in the nation. Like, I'm excited to see South Carolina again, you know. I know that they had a hard time last year um, just dealing with that and just, knowing that you know they were right there and it was theirs so um i'm excited to see them again um and just know what we can bring to the table and just play hard for 40 minutes and more T tell me what you've done off season in developing your skills for this team 
Um, I'll definitely say just working on my left hand more, um, getting to the basket, you know, changing my speed um, from fast to slow. I feel like that's what I really focus on um, in this offseason, uh, being the best version of myself and for the team. How do you balance practices, um, after practices in the gym, the workouts, the extra stuff, and your classes? Um, I think just setting the goal, you know, managing your time. Um, I have a little calendar where it tells me to break down my time. So when I wake up, first thing I do is do my devotional um, and get ready for the day. And then I come in, get some shots in before practice. And then after practice, I'll get some more shots in. And then, you know, the rest of the night, I'll just focus on doing my homework. So I feel like just managing your time is really important in college. Is that something that you've had to do more here? Or what kind of advice would you give that high school young lady who wants to get to the collegiate level on something that you wish that you would have known? Um, I would definitely say it's, it's definitely new managing my time here. Um, it's grown a lot, but I definitely just say, you know, taking that time to manage your time and get your homework done early. Uh, I think that's very important at this level to get all that done so then you have your day and you're not stressing or anything like that. But I think um, for anyone in high school that's going to play at the college level, just the main focus is just believing in yourself and knowing that you can do it.